Four of the capital murder trial continues for Facundo Chavez. Chavez is charged with capital murder for allegedly shooting, beating, and killing El Paso County Sheriff Deputy Peter Herrera back in 2019 in San Elizario. KTSM 9 News reporter Skylar Soto has been following this trial for us uh, last week and back again this week. She brings us the latest on today's proceedings. And Skylar, what was new today? Andy, today we saw autopsy photos of Deputy Herrera. He did sustain multiple beatings and gunshot wounds. Court did start around 9.15 this morning, and the state called two more witnesses to the stand. The testimony that stood out the most was from the chief medical examiner, Dr. Mario Rascon. Dr. Dr. Rascon testified that Deputy Herrera had blunt force injuries to his forehead, cheekbone area, and his nose. Rascon testifying this was a life-threatening injury. And in quote saying, the cause of death is multiple gunshot wounds. Now after seeing the autopsy photos, Dr. Rascon pointed out that Herrera sustained at least four gunshot wounds, and you could see the entries and exits of some of those bullets. Deputy Herrera had his left kidney removed, and he also experienced damage to his heart, diaphragm, and his spine. Now the state rested and the defense wanted the verdict to go directly to the jury and the judge denied it. Now after recess, the defense was set to call their first witness to the stand and an argument ensued about documents that the state wanted to review and in doing so, the judge decided to adjourn for the day and it will pick back up tomorrow at 9 a.m. And for a recap of today's trial, you can find it over at our website at KTSM.com.